What's up YouTube, Deadraw here. So just a quick little news, some pretty cool thing that I'm really excited about. So this got announced. Um, this is the Rarity Collection 2. This is super, super hype. Um, obviously you guys, we, we had the first Rarity Collection and it offered a bunch of reprints um, in multiple different rarities so that people were able to get easy ash blossoms easy things because everything was super but also could get a qcr ash blossom so it introduced the highest rarity for a lot of cards which is amazing um i love this to kind of style of set now um yeah like i it, it this is awesome so it's going to be released on in may 2024 so that's only a few months from now um that's not too bad uh that's really awesome so let's kind of get into it. it says a rarity collection is a rapid fire waterfall of hired um high high powered cards in seven of the game's most popular foil rarities awesome um last year's 25th anniversary collection blew everyone's socks off so we started to work on a sequel right away in order to get out as fast as we can we've made some sort of changes to the configuration while leaving all good stuff and value intact okay so rarity collection two packs have twice as many ultra and secret rares per pack which gives you twice as many chances as luxury rares per pack Ooh, okay so we are going to be getting more ultras and more secrets per pack that's already awesome okay um yeah so we have quarter century rares prismatic style ultimate rares collectors rares and platinum so uh we you know all the same rarities are back not looking like there's anything else so we've cut back on the packaging so there will be fewer packs you'll need to open and fewer foil wrappers to throw away to get the same number of cards you're looking for and double the cards per pack about two-thirds of the packs uh pack should have at least one luxury rare this time around and a third should have more than one wow okay so at least one luxury rare this time hold on let me see let me reread that hold on you get the same number of cards you're looking for and with double cards per pack about two-thirds of packs should have at least one luxury rare that's actually a really really good ratio for having at least one rush luxury rare even if it's ulti or a collectors and it's not that qcr that's still awesome and then yeah, and then one third should have more than one. So I like these. This is awesome already. The ratios are better and everything. Um, if you missed the first rarity collection, how this works, we blah blah blah. Um, yeah, so we we won't really get into that. Most of us know what that is. If not, go check out the first rarity collection. I opened a bunch of it. I have a video. Um, I'll leave a card up here that you can watch. Um, I, it's basically I'm on the hunt for opening some rarity collection. You can watch me open some of that. Um. <laughs> okay so it's opening it's a higher yeah we got that if you haven't experienced all foil extravagant you're in for a treat each contact oh, pack will contain the two secrets so each pack contains two secret rares four ultra rares and three super rares so we're larger pack size this time guys so it's rather than five cards per pack it's nine cards per pack right so that's awesome. Um, that's super hype. And then all different cards from the first rarity catch collection. Uh, they're all going to be different. So everything's going to be different, which is super exciting. Um, access, access, cold talker, magician souls. Those are two cards that, you know, uh, very, very needing a reprint. Um, silent swordsman and silent sword uh, magician. Um, okay, so that's cool. Cards that will glisten and gleam in your hand and they wait for the perfect moment to seal your victory. Tournament mainstays like Droll and Lockbird, Ghost Ogre and Snow Rabbit, Ghost Mourner and Moonlit Chill, and Fantastical Dragon Phantasme. That type, we I wanted these. Um, I'm hoping there's a few other things. Let's see what other what else they have to say. Um, we got uh field cards from competitive Visa Star story decks. So Primitive Planet, Pearl and Rhino, Rekophobia, and Race Soul, and Peaceful Planet Clarium. So the Manadium and like all that story archetype stuff that ties together is going to be in this as well. So this set is ceiling to be pretty dang good, in my opinion. Um, especially since we're going to be able to get those QCR drolls 
and well myself i'm not into qcr so you, I, as if you guys know i'm more into the uh, collector's rare so I, i'll be able to get all the girl ghost girls and collector's rare and finish my hand trap collection and collector's rare super exciting there um and then we'll get into it then we got that ip mask arena art um and the the fierce version of rescue cat okay will now be available in all seven rarities plus appaloosa bowl of the goddess plus dozens and dozens more whether you're a collector of competitive duelist 25th anniversary is full of cards that everyone will want to get their hands on all right so i'm super super pumped for this set i'm super excited i they missed out on so many cards in the first set that i just wish that i could have so here's to hope and i'm really hoping for like cosmic cyclones like one of the biggest ones i'm hoping for um it'd be really nice to see some other stuff as well um i hope i hope we get some like some you know, some goodies that we are not really expecting um but i'm i'm really really excited for this set guys let me know what you think please comment like subscribe and we'll talk to you later